This is Code.org. I'm currently working on the Accelerated Intro to Computer Science course, and I'm on the lesson The Artist 2. Here's the solution to the previous puzzle. What? I did all that work. Can you add just two more blocks to complete the drawing? Oh my goodness, they're going crazy here. All right, well, let's make sure this th uh, works. And it does. Okay. We need two more blocks. Well, we got one full laddery thing. How many ladders do we need? Four of them. So obviously, I'm going to grab this repeat, and I'm going to put a repeat inside of a repeat inside of a repeat, <laughs> right? So all of this code is going to run four times. What's going to run four times? Well, I'm going to repeat drawing a square ten times. So I'm going to draw ten squares four times in a row, so 40 total. Right? And this would work, right? I'm just asking the computer to keep drawing squares. How many squares? Well, four times in a row, I want you to draw 10 squares. And when you're drawing those squares, randomize the color. And, oh yeah, four times, draw four lines in turn. Because that's what's actually creating the square. Then move forward by 20 and draw more. So this will just stack our ladder and our artist is going to disappear off the page. Bye, artist. So... What I need here is what I need with all squares, and I need a right turn. Now the trick is, do I put it up here, or up here, or down here? You actually want to do it towards the bottom, I think, because if I do this, yep, I turn right away, and I go off this page. So I want my artist to get started right where he's at, and then once he's done drawing that whole square, I mean the whole ladder, right, ten times it's going to run all of this code. And then finally, when it's done running ten times, it will run what's beneath it, and turn right once, hit the bottom here, and then repeat all of that four times. Let's give this a shot. Looking good. Ta-da! Awesome. Onward.